On the 26th of September 2002, this desktop was delivered. I'm now having trouble with it. Um, it crashes most of the time when the virus update comes in. It's Windows XP, it's old. It's now done, I'm doing this, it's 2009 early in that year. And I'm due to get a new machine on this study and recording. Which means I've got to put this away. And what we're trying to do is get the uh, company to take this and dispose of this machine. I feel like I can trade it. Since 2002, it's given a for service, but this is the way things seem to be these days. No. One of the jobs I have to do, um, you can see, but I click on that and it's supposed to, it's a delay. After I've checked emails and stuff, is I will be deleting bookmarks. I've already deleted so far the bookmarks related to what I call e commerce and internet banking. It takes a long time, about an hour or two hours to do total wipe the disk and I don't want to do that because then it would then start demanding to get updates since the beginning of XP and that would be two service packs and that is uh, a major problem um, log out that's a church account so um I'm going to do another check on. It seems pitifully slow. Webmail. I'm checking Virgin Media. And then I'll check all these and I'll delete the subfolder for Webmail. I have now dealt with Firefox. I have logged out of stuff, clear cookies. I've left the folders where you can find the forums and in webmails but they won't be able to log in because they won't have any good data so there won't be passwords or anything as uh, so I want to do but the next trick now is Outlook Express the next job now I do a check on the email is to remove accounts um, it's all those accounts I've got to remove because they've got passwords too. Um, some of them I don't check that often, like this one and Discovery. I've never put them on the laptop, and I'm going to have point. to for now. Um, there's history behind them. Save the points. Uh, I'm not going to get for this. When I was looking for stuff, um, oh, this is some junk mail that's coming. So this is what I'm going to be doing here on here: tools, accounts, remove. Yeah, I'm going to close that one and just check now the Google, and then no. Nope. Tools, accounts, no doggy will remove. And I have to do all the others like that. One of the things I've now got to do is all the dial ups have got to go. I've got to locate my um, Terrapin FTP program and delete to, the, to them. And I've got to go through subfolders and delete uh, stuff which has personal information and uh, a file which lists all my uh, dial-up stuff and that is then I'll be shutting down and dismantling and that'll be it for this one right what I'm doing now at this point is I'm copying some files from work to my memory pen drive um, so they can be saved to the laptop and uh, everything else 
It doesn't matter if people can read them. I've removed personal information. Oh, actually, I haven't. I've got to go back to the church stuff and remove the church stuff, and then because that's got personal information of members. Well, I'll just remove the uh, directories, and then I sign out of MSN. Clear the recycle bin. And then that's it. I, I start the smoky process. Sorry. This machine's been with me for quite a long time. It's the longest time machine I've ever had. Well, that's that. Better go and do the church stuff now. Um, well, am I looking for Newcastle Church of Christ administration? And all that of that stuff I've got to start deleting, so I better get on with it. This is a remote control keyboard and the mouse. They're not going, they're staying, they're independent. I packed the mouse in already. This is the uh, I probably need to do some cleaning up. The mouse is gone. Shutting down. After shut down I will go to the loo and start the decommissioning process with dismantling physically of this computer. Right. I've now put the machine uh, in. It uh, fitted in those things I still kept and the uh, official keyboard I packed away in its box and it's there I think other things go along here and I think it's possible to sit there that's the things like mouses and probably books and that. I don't know if I'll be I'll be wanting them back um, that's some of the peripherals those peripherals are all mine now I've got the really nasty task of dismantling the uh, monitor. I've already difficult job because I've got to get up to the. You probably can't see it in the darkness. Um, unplug for a few things and then get uh, the uh, broadband thing there. Put that up somewhere because I've got to be able to use the laptop at the moment. And um, the next task will be getting this all looked down. I've got a poorly arm, and uh, I'm on medication. And I say it's at the end of an hour. Finally, ah, uh, it's gone. Still a few leads in that. Uh, an old card reader. I don't know if that will be going in the new one. Finally, the box all the leads and may try and recover this if they're going to just destroy it I'm going to try and cover that because those are good speakers although I do have another set of speakers elsewhere and this is the um, boxed up monitor ready almost to go it's now ten past eight and it's between ten and half ten and I'm supposed to be being picked up and I've got to get this downstairs and down a flight of stairs because our lift's not working as well.